Hey guys, so I normally do not make videos on, so this is Saturday and I'm going to make a video this Saturday because I thought this was important enough. Uh, the question is, is the monthly magic box worth it? Or I'm going to title it probably a little differently. First of all, there's been a lot of complaints about the monthly magic box not shipping on time or shipping very late. But all the YouTubers, so first of all, I'm biased against them because they didn't give me a box. If they had given me a box, I wouldn't be saying all this shit about them, right? I would be like, oh, no, nah, they're the best. You know, everyone should buy it because um, they would be giving me free stuff every month. So when a YouTuber opens it, it's not because they purchased it. It is much more likely, especially the bigger YouTubers, they were given it for free or they were sponsored to open it, meaning they not only got it for free, but they also got money. But the large majority of YouTubers, I'm guessing, are getting this for free. And there have been lots of complaints. You go on their Facebook and you can just see comment section. It's all complaints, all whining and all um, complaints. So they have some type of delivery problem, but strangely, they don't have any problem delivering to the YouTubers who are promoting them. And I can say this with complete arrogance because I'm not supported by them. I never want to be supported by them. I never want to get a magic monthly box. I will never do that to you guys because if I do that, I can't say this, right? I mean, this would pretty much, they would be like, okay, give us back boxes. Anyway, the monthly magic box, in addition to shipping late for some people, uh, I don't even know. I would probably say, I mean, one post person posted, hey, you know, I'm a kid. My dad's getting mad and he's writing emails to them and apparently they are not responding to my email. Is that it actually isn't that valuable. So you spend $25 at your local game store, not only are you supporting that kind of place that you play at, but you also are, you know, having more fun. So FM, that's a whole month of FM. And what did you get? This? You know how much this is? I have tried for four years to buy them out, Dave and Adams, to buy them out of this particular binder or a few different binders because I like to keep all my cards stored in storage once a year. And I haven't, it's $2.80. It's always been $2.80. I actually got a discount. I think I got a 5% discount plus a free um, Sun Titan mat when I ordered like enough of them. And I've tried to buy them out every single time. So that's not $10 like a lot of people are saying. It's $3. Uh, the booster pack is, let's say generously $4. The card sleeves, I honestly wouldn't pay anything for it, but I'd say two bucks a piece, four bucks, four bucks, 11 bucks, and then you get some candy, whatever. Um, you, the money would be much better spent if you have a local game store, going to every FNM, winning some promos, having a fun time. And $25 is a lot to a local store. And not only that, but you get your DCI number in, which helps them when they get the free event stuff. So yeah. Um, Monthly magic box, I'll, I'll go ahead and say, because I actually did get another box, not from the same company. If they gave me a box, I would not be making this video. And that's why you don't see any negative videos about them, because they're honestly just giving free boxes away to these YouTube personalities. And no one's speaking out against it, uh, at least publicly. So I have nothing to lose. Bring it. Bring it. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>